Hello Star Wars fans and collectors, it's me Jellamaster98 back again with another Star Wars video. In today's Star Wars video we're going to be taking a look at a Star Wars collection update. As per usual with these videos it's just latest updates of reorganising my shelves, new figures and obviously some new stuff that I've added to the collection. So uh, let's take a look at my Star Wars collection update. So what we'll do is just start off over here. So we'll take a look at this shelf first. This is the shelf from episodes one to the Clone Wars. So obviously it's various characters from the Clone Wars TV show episode one and episode two. You can see there's a few bits of uh, dust lingering about there, so I do need to uh, give these a clean again. So as you see, it's obviously numerous characters from numerous films. So there are characters there from the Clone Wars, Episode 2 and Episode 1. We'll just sit down and show you the other parts. So they've got Stormtrooper just at the side there. He's just chilling. Characters from the Mandalorian TV show. There's a few characters at the very bottom from the Book of Bubba Fett as well, with some accessories. As you see there are numerous figures scattered in these uh, parts of the shells from different areas of Star Wars. And also there's characters there from episode 8 and episode 9 as well. Characters are just underneath there. You'll see the Bottom here as well, we've obviously got poster there, Darth Vader helmet, Bubba Fett helmet, Clone Chip helmet, and Luke Skywalker's helmet. Grogu is just chilling there. Got some Rebel Soldiers there as well, my Star Wars DVDs with all different uh, series and films, and obviously Django Fett there just chilling. Just going to stand up and show you the, you'll see the main part of the shelf. See on the wolf, the uh, the black jaguar picture is in the same spot. My framed Chelsea shirts in the exact same spot as well. Please excuse the glare. So they're all there. And obviously moving on to the main part, which is obviously Clone Wars, Revenge of the Sith shelf. So you've got numerous clone troopers here.
There's a few new additions there I've added to the 501st ranks, a couple more soldiers that I recently picked up from my local Forbidden Planet. There's obviously Anakin and Obi-Wan in the middle. And obviously onto Revenge of the Sith, clone troopers. Oh, there's a clone trooper that's just fallen there. <laughs> I'll have to pick him up later on. And obviously there's uh, figures from Revenge of the Sith as well. So there's characters there from Revenge of the Sith and the Clone Wars. Moving down to Solo. Characters from Solo, a Star Wars story. And obviously there's characters there from Rebels. Lanaka Rizian Battlefront figure that I recently picked up, looking the part there. As you see, this character is from Star Wars Rebels. And then moving on to Rogue One. Yeah, again, I do apologise for the glare. And figures from A New Hope. A few characters in there from The Force Unleashed as well. And moving on to The Empire Strikes Back. Definitely needs to give some of these figures a clean. There's so much dust that's built up over the past couple of months as well, which don't help. And then there's characters here from Star Wars Episode 6 Return of the Jedi. Obviously, you've got Vader, the Emperor, and Luke Skywalker there. And then there's characters from Star Wars Episode 7, The Force Awakens. So they're the uh, main shells I've just given you a look at. Like I said, do need to give them a dust in the next few days and obviously rearrange a few things to... Um, Put a few new figures on there, but apart from that, the collection is going strong. Obviously, got the Millennium Falcon light, that's just uh, there. Moving up to the shelf above the door, nothing's really changed there apart from Funko Pop that I've recently put there. And I've just rearranged some figures there as well, a few characters there. The mirror is in the same spot. Pictures. Nothing's really changed there. The wardrobes, obviously in the same spot. Rearranged a few of them lately. Got rid of a tire uh, load of old stuff there, so I've rearranged all that there, including the uh, wardrobe by the window as well. TV is in the exact same spot. So it's just stuff that stayed there the same Xbox is in the exact same spot as well the shelf above the television or TV is in the same spot just have to clean that now and again and everything 
Also I've added the uh, Hot Toys 501st Clone Troop at the back there and some other stuff. The Jack's Room little number plate is in the exact same spot. As I said I've rearranged a few things up there in the shelf there. The uh, lightsaber that I got for my birthday a few years ago is there just for a few old action figures and accessories and everything. The table, the camera tripod, laptop and the chair I used to record the reviews are just there for the time being. There's nothing really major there. So give you a look at my uh, Styles helmets from the side on. So that's not too bad. And obviously the garden and the weather is not too bad in the UK. It's been quite hot lately, past couple of weeks, but uh, I can't complain there. So obviously that's the back garden and everything. Well, apart from that, the, uh, the Styles collection is going strong as usual. Obviously more figures to be picked up hopefully soon, next few weeks. And I think more reviews to uh, review and everything as well. But I, uh, apart from that, the collection's going strong. Obviously, as I said, just need to find some uh, more room and everything for some of my uh, Star Wars figures and everything. But other than that, I'm really pleased with the collection, how it's going. And uh, obviously interacting with all uh, my uh, subscribers on YouTube and everything. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So I'd like to thank each and every one of you for watching. Be sure to stay tuned for some more Star Wars reviews as well. Got a few more videos planned in the next few days. And I'd like to take each I like to take the time to thank each and every one of you for watching this video. And I'll see you on the next one. So please be sure to obviously subscribe to the channel, follow me on Facebook and Instagram, and I will see you very soon. So until next time, thank you very much for watching. Take care, look after yourself, and as always, may the force be with you.